What's up everybody, Cam Shaft here with a quick tutorial on how to change your ETH payment schedule. Stick around. All right guys, we are back. So one of the questions I got recently was, I've set up Claymore Miner. Um, maybe I am mining with one or two GPUs and you notice that an ETH coin takes forever to mine. Um, I want to be paid out a little bit quicker. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So hopefully you have gotten your uh, miner details in there. You're going to put your payment address up in here, hit click, uh, check status. And this miner ID is not going to be the same as your wallet. So you put your wallet address up here, hit check status, status and then your miner is going to come up here. So next step, click on payouts and rounds <clears throat> excuse me in here just wanted to show you uh, you're gonna see uh, last hundred payouts in your um, your income for the last thousand rounds you can see some spikes in there um, and then approximately how much you're gonna make per month and week and day uh, next let's check settings so this is where the magic happens um, I love this beta feature so send you can click on here send an email if one of my workers goes offline uh, click on there. You're going to enter in your email address. Boom. Payment threshold in Ether. Minimum 0 .0, 0 0.05 Ether. Max 10. So if you're one hell of a miner and you have you know tons of rigs going on and you're pumping out Ether like it's no business, then you can set it to 10. Um, if you would like to go ahead and get it a little sooner, you can change your, your threshold here. Um, so let's say I wanted to go for uh, 0.5, right? I want to get paid out a little bit sooner because uh, I'm right at that threshold. And you can see here there's a fixed transaction fee of 0.001 Ether will be deducted if you choose a lower payment than one Ether. Um, so real quick, we can, uh, we can Google this and we can go, okay, let's see how much that's going to cost me. ETH to USD, click on your converter. I use the uh, coin gecko one, um, and then let's put that in there. Ethereum, man, going back up there. We hit like 220 the other day. Now we're back up to 317, that's amazing. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and paste that in there. You can see it's 31 cents uh, charge to go ahead and pull out a little bit early, you know, Think about if you want to pull out during these price spikes, this is what you're going to want to do. 31 cents is nothing compared to if I had pulled out yet the other day at 220 and right before that it was at, you know, 370, 380. I could have pulled out then before the before the drop. Um, so that minimal uh, 0 0.001 is definitely well worth it. Um, now, your next step is going to go ahead and to save, validate your account by completing the IP uh, given below. You can see they give you a hint, 0.142. Um, for that, you're going to go to Google once again. And this time, you're going to type in my IP, enter. Here it is. So you're going to enter this in, hit copy, paste this in there, and you're going to hit save. So we're going to hit save there. Configuration updated. Please, uh, please allow for up to one minute for the setting to be updated. So there you go. You successfully uh, change your configuration. You're going to get paid out a little quicker. However, you set up, whether it be uh, 0 0.1, uh, you know, 0 0.2, whatever. I've decided to go with a half here, so I'm going to get paid out every half of Ethereum that I mine. Um, that way, I can, um, you know, go ahead and take those funds, put it back into what I'm doing, um, and go from there. Uh, really appreciate you sticking around. Uh, don't forget our uh, miners page where you can get help. You'll see that down below. Like, click, subscribe. Uh, really appreciate you guys. You guys have a great day.